Hello, and welcome. I'm Zyndr, and I'm trying a new recording method, which is why I was looking at my frame right there. But uh, guess what we've got? A Tier 2 rocket. So we're going to head up top. I believe I placed the launch pad down. And like I said, I'm testing a new recording method. Seems to be alright so far. But you're not actually there. Are you? Hello? No. No, it wasn't there. Because I tried to throw it, and it didn't exist. Okay. So, I just realized I haven't brought a method of power transfer up here with me. Does this work? I think this is working. I think? Uh, F. Oh. Okay. Shift to exit. Uh, I'm going to be honest. I'm surprised that worked. So, uh, the... Oh. Apparently, any eye hasn't even processed anything yet. So, are you in my hand? Tier 2 rocket... Made with uh, heavy duty plates, tier 1 boosters, which is pretty simple. It's heavy duty plates, compressed meteoric iron, yellow wool, and the oxygen vents. And pretty much the rest of it's the same. Tier 1 engine, bunch of plates. So, I've got this crafted, I've got it fueled up. In my inventory, I've got a location card, a dialing device, a portal controller, and 12 portal frames, and a piece of meteoric iron because it's there. Look, check this out. I found a potato gun in one of the uh, the uh, moon dungeons. I'm probably not going to use it. In fact, let's just put it in there. And uh, I guess we're going to head to the moon. Not the moon. Mars. Head to Mars. I want you to know that interdiction matrix warning spam is annoying. But uh, let's close F3. Just trying to monitor things, make sure they're functioning. I was like, man, that looks really odd. That's my feet. Entity dot spaceship dot. Or entity dot spaceship t two dot name. Uh, so complete. Uh, yes, there. So, I did a little bit of looking into some of the things, such as the terraformer. Gravity thirty eight percent habitable, no oxygen. I still haven't, uh, cannot create a space station here. I didn't want to create a space station there. But uh, I still haven't acquired the materials for that. Let's go to Mars! And, uh, I do plan to do that. What am I in? Actually, I'm not in anything yet. Oh, right. You don't have to hold space for this one, because you go bouncing around. Boing. Oh, God, it's nighttime. Uh, out of this mode, please. So, supposedly you can get a slimeling pet out of this if you just break the shell a few times. Well, apparently not quite as much, but... Uh, do we have anything showing up on the immediate map? No, we do not. Inside of here is our launch pad, and that... Yeah, of course, that won't work. We're just going to leave that there for the moment. Uh, oh. Hello. Your name is Blarg. And you're now sitting. 
Your favorite food is cooked potatoes. Wait, can you... Do you grow in size? Because that would be disturbing. You know what? Egg with it. You can follow me. And you can put uh, some kind of things in here to give it actual storage space, but... Eh. Okay, so... What are you doing? So, I have brought the stuff to make a portal, and as such, we are going to do this. Bing, 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 bing. Bing. Bong. Oh, ooh, flying. And, oops. And location card. Oh, right. Unique identifier. Uh, why am I even messing with that? Uh, no, no, no. Emerald. And this is Mars, so I think we'll go with a name tag because we can get pets here. That sounds like a plan. So, we're going to... Right. We're going to add the overworld. Oops. Oh, come on. Don't fight with me. Overworld. Going to add the nether. Although... Is it this? Or is it this? I am apparently retarded and don't remember what I was doing. Twilight Forest and the moon was what, another star? I guess we'll find out if the moon was another star. You cannot dial a portal that is already active. Well, that said, I'm glad that I expanded the uh, the machine. Mm. No, actually, that. Uh, I expanded the uh, dimensional stabilizer. No, wait, stop. Crap. Before we go anywhere, we need to go back in here, because I need to prevent the situation I ha just had, and I need to disable this, so I can get back to Mars. Oh, ooh, okay. Always expect a little bit of frame rate lag when loading into a dimension. Oh. Okay, so. Haven't done any more work on that, obviously. I'm probably going to do the rest of the house expansion in the... Uh, the live stream that I wish to do. Uh, you know what? Let's just pop over to the moon for a second. So. Once the bubble re-expands, because it has to redo it every time. I move the oxygen compressor here, surround it in leaves. Some of them are uh, the willow leaves. And this is outputting 222 a second. This is using 20 a second, and this is using 160. Uh, this creates a pocket of air, so I do not need my tanks here. And then I expanded it further, obviously, so I could fill up my tanks while here. Uh, this doesn't seem to go down in power for some reason. I think it's a bit broken. Granted, the sun's out right now, and this is the photovoltaic cell I made. I put it on here to keep this powered during the daytime, and that's just sitting there for the moment. But, we need to find some dash on Mars, and I'd like to get this filled up. And I just threw in some redstone lamps with redstone blocks because, well, I thought that the blood lights weren't doing it, but apparently it 
it doesn't handle light very well, and it's just based on the whether or not the sun is up on the moon, which is kind of annoying actually, because it means it can be really, really dark in here. So I'm definitely gonna do any like major space-related building on a space station, and not on the moon or Mars. Mars, I think, was a little bit less of an issue for the short period of time I was there. But it's hard to say because there was mobs, so it might have been nighttime, but it might not have been nighttime. But I'm going to take these, throw them in there. I added two more chests onto the storage system, so I'm not worried about running out of space by throwing stuff in there anytime soon. Okay, so, now, what I can do here, is I can terminate this, remove this, Mars, I feel like I'm missing something on this, eh, so we'll make Mars orange, whoops, dial, to the Mars, Ah. Oh. so, I am now going to set up a waypoint here, of course. La portal. There we go. And I think the first thing we're going to do is try and find a dungeon. Now, they're set up in pretty much an identical way to the moon dungeons. Which also means that with my luck, I'm not going to find anything. Oh, look. Blue slimeling egg. Another one. So many slimelings. Uh, map? See, this is this is the unfortunate problem. Trying to find a dungeon. Although I gotta admit, I really like the uh, the terrain of Mars. I mean, look look at the contouring on that. Now I believe that. Mars does technically have an atmosphere, it's just not breathable by humans, because there is uh, storms on Mars, I believe. I could be wrong. I could be an idiot. Anything I've ever seen on TV could be wrong. Oh, here we go. So this has green brick. Wish I could claim it. Wow. What an interesting sound effect. Now, so I actually don't know offhand what the boss is for the Mars dungeons. So I suppose we'll figure that out soon enough. Oh, fine, fine. Uh, one energy blaster, please. You wanna sit here and you wanna poke me? I will shoot you to death. I don't even care. You know why? Because I've got plenty enough blood to not really care. Stop being such a pain. Fine. Go away. A room with a chest. Portal spawners. Nifty, nifty. I uh, don't really care about the rest of it. Hey, right, another chest. Uh, single-use safari net, and some wheat, and a stencil. Eh. 
Those are creeper eggs. I know that because I have any I I I I I I I I I I That's terrifying. How do I hurt you? Oh. That's an interesting mechanic, to say the least. So, as I damage you, you start to lose your extra heads, huh? You die already. Is dead. Dead, 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 dead. Oh, hey, heal the heart. So, I believe we should have gotten a tier 2 dungeon key. Because we definitely did. Uh, let me turn off the. Oh, turn off the energy blaster. And here we go. What is in the tier 2 dungeon chest? Automatic cargo rocket. Cool, cool. Uh, tier, very helpful. Uh, I'm not terribly interested in... Hmm, right lighting, huh? Not terribly interested in anything else sitting in here. So, that's a bit unfortunate. But, I will just... Yeah. You know, I somehow managed to get the creeper eggs. That's curious. Uh, we'll throw you there. That is some crazy ambience, I must say. So, can I actually pick these up or is that just a glitch? Seems like it was some kind of a glitch. Oh well, joke's on them. So, throw that out, throw that out, and it's time to vacate the premises. So the automatic cargo rocket requires a launch controller, which requires dash. Which unfortunately means that we need to find dash. And if we look here, dash looks like that. It spawns in sort of a dark layer, I would assume. Let's do our digging over here at the portal. So, this right here looks like the proper colored stuff, I think. But I'm not entirely sure at what level I can expect to find Dash. And unfortunately, in order to find Dash, I 
wonder just how far down this goes. So that is iron ore. What? How did you get here? Idiot. So there is some copper ore. Aha! Crap. I actually didn't want to break that. Uh, there's a very good reason for that, too. So. I'm going to pop out around here. Like so. Is that going to be enough room? Uh, it should be. We'll just pop out those just in case. There's a very good reason why I'm doing this. I'm going to grab this. I'm going to grab my digital miner. I'm going to set, let's see, what my feet height is 19. Okay, so we're going to set this to a height of 19 to 19. A radius of one. I'm going to set this to inverse, which means it'll pick up anything. Set this to silk touch. Now, this leaves me with one unfortunate thing. Actually, I can put this in there to jump start it. Ah, there we go. So, Oops. Now, I can take that back out. And what this will allow me to do is, obviously, now I can put item stack dash in here. And I will now want silk touch off. Oh. Nope, come back. So, now, what I can do at this point is if I go get my little energy thing back. I have no idea where I put my energy cube. The uh, thing from uh, mechanism. I can't remember for the life of me where I put it. So, put a barrel here and I've been refining this fuel. I'm going to have to get more soon at this rate. But, uh, yeah, I don't remember where I put it. I don't believe it was inside of the... yeah. See, now this is a concern. We're at 170 million. And I feel like this should be on. In fact, let's check and see. Yeah, it is on, but this is glitched. Because you see now it's on. So, unfortunately that does mean that this is broken. But there's not really anything I'm going to be able to do about that. Eh. Yeah. There's not much I can do about that considering my current setup. Other than maybe try and file a bug report on it. But now this is going to start spinning up and my power should start increasing. Oh. So then eventually I want to get probably two more of those in there, but I'm probably going to have to build a, as I'm going to call it, a breeder reactor. If that makes any sense. In fact, on that topic, whoops. Let's just pull out six stacks of coal. Throw all of this in there. All right, I borrowed the hopper. I was making bronze. Funny thing about bronze, for some unknown reason, the way the uh, thing from which medoodle 
Are you keeping up with that? No. The thing from uh, the Mariculture, the automatic or dictionary, isn't functioning right anymore. Uh, for some reason, it's doing weird things to the ingots. Like, if we look at bronze, see how it says ingot bronze? The thing is, is I can't actually... Oh, oh, now you work. Make me a liar, why don't you? Yeah, I was having issues where it wasn't requesting, but that might have actually been fixed already, I guess. I do believe there was an update, but I didn't look too hard at what was in it. I think there might have been a logistics pipes update, actually. Hmm. But, now that we have gone to the moon, or the thing, uh, I forget what the materials were for a space station. I believe one of them was an advanced wafer. You know what? Let's... Uh, I forget what the actual values were. No. no let me think. 10? 10, 10, 10, 20... Plus twenty four. I feel like I'm missing something. Another twelve, maybe fifty six. You know what? If I make extras, I don't even care. So I want no, not you yet. Emmy containment wall. I'm going to make an auto crafting thing. Why? Because there are certain things that I want crafted and logistics pipes. Well, a lot of these things I'm going to move them into here so I can free up thing space for other things such as all of the carpenter's blocks and whatnot. Things I want to be able to request on demand. So if I make this a 5x5, five five, then I'm going to need 6 times 9. I have a feeling I made way too many of these. Oh. Oh, that's, that's a problem. No, not dark cable. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? Oh, that's a problem. What? Oh, right, 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 right. I was like, what's going on here? I didn't make the cable. I made the dust. Yeah, if I'm right, I need to make some more quartz dust. Which seems to be a common occurrence, actually. I had to do this whenever I was making uh, two more storage things as well. And we'll see how far I can get with what I have. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. And then one, two, three, four, five. I have this feeling I made too many. As in, 12 too many. Ooh. Ooh. Do I dare risk it? <sighs> this is risky business. I'm going to be honest, I'm surprised I didn't crash. So, we're going to run all of the FE, or iron, into here. E, FE, oh. 
This is going to put a heck of a drain on my power, that's for sure. Okay. Now if I just pop this in here. What? Gold? Oh yeah, gold. Okay. I don't know why I was thinking AU was aluminum. I think it was... I think I was thinking it was an AL. But, uh, anyhow. Uh, aluminum phosphate. What can I do with you? Three hundred thousand. Okay. Uh, yeah. Mine chem is useful. Very, very useful. So, I made thirteen. So I need what forty-one more. There, I'll do that. Uh, actually, that. Uh, whoops. Oh, nah, that's not really an issue. What would be an issue is if I perhaps made way too many of these. Although, if it has support for the other things, and I'm probably going to end up being way too long on this because I wasn't paying attention to the clock, but... Like I said, for one, I'm testing a new recording method. Oh. Wasn't paying attention. Well, let's see if I can tear this apart as well, then. Oh, what do you know? I can disintegrate this as well. Uh-oh. Oh, that's going very laggily. I'm assuming the lag is situations where there would normally be crashes, and there has since been, you know, stuff put in place to prevent that. And that's what the little laggy bits are. Well, at least that's what I'm going to assume the little laggy bits are. There, and I'll make some gravel, because why not? Get my iron back. Something doesn't seem right here. Huh. Strange. Very strange. So, I'm going to need 9 internal, not 9, 27 internal components. Uh, I'm probably going to use, hmm, be honest, whatever I'm going to use, it's going to be based on bits of simplicity for one. Oops. Okay, so, nine left. Now I need to make 27 internal components comprised of either crafting CPUs or providers. So, crafting CPUs, I will make... Why am I always out of silicon? Ah. <sighs> All right, I took the automatic dictionary converter down. Now, I know it converts this properly, at least. So, we will make... Please be enough. Uh, I only have 18. Well, I guess we're going to make seven pattern providers. No, nine. Nine pattern providers. Because... That's all I've got for that. Please tell me pattern providers don't take golden ones, because that would suck. Not gold. Uh, diamond. 
What a question. Where the heck is it? Why am I having such a hard time locating it in this mess of things? Oh, it's right here. Oh, it takes diamond. You know what? Hmm. Okay. I guess I'm going to call this good and I will make those off camera and get the auto crafting stuff ready. That's a bit unfortunate. But, uh, yeah, so I'm going to call that good. Although, uh, next time we may not pick up here, I want to try out another mod. If I'm I'm going to do a little bit of research into it, but if I'm understanding this right, I should be able to get, like this, the wireless block extender. If I'm understanding what it does, I should be able to do a nifty little design idea. But I'm going to call this good, and I will see you guys next time. And make sure to let me know how you think the quality compares to my previous videos. Uh, I'm recording this, I believe, in Lossless. That was my goal. And for all I know, I might have completely screwed this up and might have to go for a backup. But I'm going to call this good. I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.